to YouTube and to my subscribers. Hey guys, doing? Welcome back. Let's start doing the analysis. What's going on, Hitha? Well, <laughs> what happened to the meme stocks? Oh my God, they're falling. Wink, wink. Surprise. Wink, wink. <laughs> what did I tell you, guys? Stop getting fucking uh, investment advice on Reddit. <laughs> okay, stop. Stop, please. Save your money. Oof. Uh, painful for a lot of people, I know. I know. But, you know, when I, I grew up in a different era, right? I'm older than you guys, mostly. I grew up that when you said or did something stupid, nobody made uh, allowed you to forget. <laughs> so they, they, they bashed you. They just kept harping on it. Believe me, you don't make the same mistake twice. Uh, yeah, not, not because you're afraid of losing money or, you know, whatever. It's You don't want to hear it. <laughs> you don't want to get trashed for doing something stupid. So you don't do it twice. So I, I do things differently. I don't say, oh, gosh, well, well, okay, next time maybe you'll do it differently. Gosh, golly. <laughs> no. <laughs> you know, me too. It's okay. I lose too. <laughs> no. <laughs> Stop. Stop listening to gurus on the internet who've never even seen a bear market. They don't even know what technical analysis is. Stop. Please, for the love of God, stop doing that to yourselves. These quote-unquote, uh, you know, sudden experts that popped up all over the place. I'm a stock analyst. Buy the dip. Burp, burp. <laughs> no. <laughs> they don't have a clue. They're very good at marketing. I'll give them that. I suck at ma marketing. I'll tell you how it is. You won't like it, but I'll be right most of the time, not always. And if I'm not right, I'm wrong. Look at my VIX call. VIX call was horrible. Disaster. Where is the VIX? Uh, it was breaking out, looking good, and then what happened? Kaboom, right in my face. Wrong. Eh. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Boom. Wrong. It's okay, I'm wrong. What can I do? You think I have a crystal ball? Or am I pretending I have a crystal ball and I know? I don't know. All right. So please stop listening to these gurus that have never seen a bear market. Okay, please. I used to be you, don't forget. So I don't like these people. They annoy me because they cost me a lot of money and I don't want them to cost you a lot of money. So. Um, where is my AMC call? All right, here it is. Here it is, back November 26th, and I had many more before that. All right, I said, look, short setup. Boom, da dun da -dun, dun You're right. da 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 da, -da, -da. <laughs> uh, I forgot the song, To the Price is Right. Uh, anyway, it's down to 23. I think that's a 35% loss. And that's 35% from zero. Now, remember, no matter where price can go, it could be a gazillion dollars, doesn't matter. You're always 100% from zero. So you can have a whole bunch of zero, I mean, 100% gains here, 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 here. All these 100%, the only 100% that matters is the one that goes to zero. So this is a 35, 33, whatever it is, percent drop. That means you only got 67% of your money left. So if you had $10,000, you got, what, 60, not even. You have 65%, right? That's all. You got 65% of your money. You have $6,500 left. And that's assuming that, you know, you bought here and not somewhere up here. Because then those mathematics get a lot worse. Um, game. How's game doing today? Hmm, I wonder. This was posted back on December 1st. And I said, oh, look at this short setup. Okay. The next big short setup is coming up. Boom. Ta -da -da -da. 138 today. Okay. Big drop. Don't listen to experts on Reddit. They are clueless. Uh, you know, for 11 years now, the theme has been buy the dip, buy the dip, buy the dip. They conditioned everybody 
a new generation that, hey, you know, the way you become rich is you buy the dip. You know what's going to happen? The day is going to come when you're going to buy that dip and it's going to keep on dipping. I'm telling you, it will. You, you guys don't believe it, but <laughs> you will when it's done. Believe me. So I urge caution. Big caution. Um, and also, just kind of let me point this out as well. Okay. If you if you go back here, yeah, I give you references. It's not it's not like I don't give you references. And you can also click on this little arrow here, and it'll show you. All right, big topping pattern. Hopefully it'll work. Boom, straight down. That's a sixty-five percent drop, I think. Uh, same one here. Where is it? There it is. There's another one. Another short setup. Okay. I give you references. It's all on there. Okay. So make sure that whoever you're listening to has a track record and just doesn't willy nilly tell you whatever they want. <laughs> you know, remember, if they don't scare you out, they're going to wear you out and then you're going to puke it up. Okay. And eventually you're going to puke it up. And that's the way markets work. Uh, Sheba. Remember this? False breakout. December 1st. Told you. False breakout. What happened since? Down. Ba -dum, ba -dum, boom. Down. It was a false breakout. It's withering away. Uh, where is Ethereum? Uh, ah, there it is. I'm I'm selling and taking all profits. Forty five seventy five. Four thousand five hundred seventy five dollars. Where is it today? Okay. Three thousand seven hundred. Okay. Again, I get references. You can come and see the my my uh Bitcoin bullish call back here. Okay. There it is, off to the moon, baby. So make sure who you're listening to has a good track record. Not a perfect one. No one has a perfect one. And make sure that that person can assume responsibility for their bad calls. And that's okay. Nothing wrong with being wrong. There's something wrong with staying wrong. You start selling cute little stories. All right. Bitcoin. Breaking key support. I posted it as soon as I could. All right. Boom. Back down. This is a key area, and it's breaking down. Not good. How about Tesla? All right? Tesla. Double top. Classic. Boom. If you liked it at 1245, you're going to love it at 961. <laughs> right? Uh, again, I give references. This is the same pattern <clears throat> that you've seen in GameStop, the same that you've seen in Amer uh, AMC. Okay? It's the same pattern. There's nothing different. Same thing. And remember, they don't scare you out. They're going to wear you out. And that's the way that works. Uh, Turkish Lira. Okay. <laughs> this Warren Mosler, he, he's funny. Oh, I love, I love the Turkish Prime Minister or whatever he calls himself. The Sheikh or whatever. Right? That's what he said right back here. He goes, yes, Erdogan is right. He has it right. He must lower interest rates. Okay, what happened? <laughs> wow, talk about, imagine calling yourself a, a, a banking insider, a monarist. You know, you know how the monetary system works. You're an insider, uh, an economist, right? You're the father of MMT, <laughs> and you crash the whole entire... <laughs> Boom, thank you very much. Kaboom, everything blows up. 85 million people are now suffering as a result. Turkish Lira is down, I think, 50% at this point. All right. I've been talking about this for a very long time. Very long time. What an epic mistake. And yet people listen to this guy. 
He doesn't have a clue as to what he's talking about, but they listen to him. Uh, the, the central, he says the central bank sets interest rates. Really? Why is the central bank interest rate at 15% and the Turkish lira 10-year bond is at 20? And in fact, it's now up to 20.67%. It's going in the opposite direction of where interest rates were set by the central bank. Epic mistake. Okay. And that's why I love this little, you can put the tweets on the, on the chart and you can see the stupid things people say. You can track them. Okay. They didn't know, they didn't know this existed. So they were making all kinds of false, crazy claims. And then this pops up. They're like, oh, shit. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't be so open on Twitter. Yeah. Yeah, you get exposed. You get exposed. Uh, so we talked about uh, Tesla. We talked about Ethereum, Shiba, Bitcoin, Ethereum. <clears throat> the only bullish call I had made, <laughs> oddly enough, was this Trump Trump stock, and I don't like Trump, uh, and it's not. It's not because I like him that I, I, I gave the setup. Where is he? Where, uh, not this one. Where is he? Where's DWC? Oh, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. At $40, and I said, look, this one's going to pop. This is a bullish setup. Boom. Thank you very much. It's up. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> In a down market, in a horrible market, I got a bullish setup. That's good. Uh, it's in. It's 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 all the printing, stupid. Yeah. Look at the company that we are surrounded with: Argentina and Turkey, in terms of inflation. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Good job, MMT. Right. It is all of the printing. It's remember we started out with pent up demand, then we went to labor shortages, then we went to supply chains, and now the new thing is peak oil. Uh, I'm sorry, not peak oil. Peak interest rates. Peak inflation. Peak inflation. Sorry, I got it right finally. It's peak inflation. <laughs> right. Okay. Come back next month, and the month after that, and the one after that, and then you can tell me if it's peak inflation or not. Because there's nothing indicating that there's peak inflation. Okay. There's nothing peaky about it. <laughs> uh, commodities are still going up. Okay. You can't claim supply chain issues uh, two years after a lockdown. <laughs> That's just stupid. That's just ridiculous. Uh, well, it's transitory. Okay. Two years is transitory. <laughs> it's been going up for two years. Inflation. Right. It's not like it just started. Two years is not transitory, and the the price levels that have risen are not going to go back down. So you, we're dealing with 6.8%, and we're hanging out. In fact, I read an article in Bloomberg yesterday. It was saying that Argentina is, are giving Argentinians are giving tips to Americans on how to deal with inflation. God, how embarrassing! How embarrassing is that? Wow. Yeah, keep saying, say transitory one more time. Go ahead. Go ahead. Tell me, tell me it's transitory. Ah, crazy. Uh, financials, be careful with them. Okay. I had a whole video about it. Um, Tesla, we talked about uh, Norwegian. You know, the new thing now is uh, I lost my ass is now replaced with the verbiage, I bought more, and I'm holding on forever. <laughs> Anybody that tells you that, that they bought more, <laughs> this is a great buying opportunity, that means they blew up their account. See, back in the day, you weren't allowed to say stupid things like that. People people would embarrass you. Today, you know, we don't want to embarrass anybody, so we don't say these things, okay? Uh yeah, Some, somebody tried to tell me, yeah, I bought more and I made money <laughs> as price came down. <laughs> oh, I love these people. They're awesome. Uh, inflation, food inflation, there's no change. Uh, look, it's higher than it, it was before. Okay. So uh, it's not, there's no peak inflation. Forget about that. All right. Forget about it. So, uh, 
please stop listening to Reddit. Uh, these people, they don't have a clue uh, as to what they're talking about. The market looks horrible. Uh, the internals are not good at all, uh, overall. Um, just be careful. There's a lot of stocks that are down 25, 30, 35, 40%. Okay, think of a, think of a house on a beach and someone comes in the middle of the night, starts taking out sand for a week. Every night they come out and take a little bit of sand. You don't notice it, but eventually that last piece of sand that they move, the whole house collapses. It's kind of like that. Although, having said that, we still don't have the bearish signals, oddly enough. Oddly enough. Uh, but that's about all that I'm privileged to say publicly. There's more to it, but not for free. All right, guys, that's it. Thank you very much. Have a great uh, rest of the day, great week. If something funky happens, then I'll come out and make another video. I'll make more posts, etc. Otherwise, uh, just be careful. Caution, 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 please. All right, take care. Bye-bye.